against the church and plan attacks on God's children. Whether you believe it or not, demons are real. Spiritual warfare is real and supernatural realm impacts your everyday life. Demons are not metaphors for evil. They're living sentient beings with wills of their own for we're not fighting against flesh and blood enemies but against rulers authorities of the unseen world against mighty powers against dark world evil spirits in the heavenly places Ephesians chapter 6 verse number 12 may God open our eyes to see hell's agenda being unleashed by hell upon the earth right now is the virus of fear the virus spread from person to person multiplying in itself rapidly bringing destruction wherever it goes this virus of fear shut down economies upset governments intimidate people to cowering in isolation make no mistake state this virus is lethal this virus can intensify over time and this virus must be stopped this virus is of course the spirit of fear intimidates fear make people pliable and easy to control fear make people to proclaim truth and we're not vigilant if fear itself is causing it to surrender your freedom in the name of security. It will cause you to set aside faith in the name of wisdom. What happened to the natural realm? Remember, it's influenced by the supernatural realm. The enemy, the devil and his demons, is testing the waters. He's testing to see what he can get away with. Your fear. He's testing the scene. Is it possible to control you by fear? Fear, and he is watching. Closely, he is serving. And if you allow fear to control you now, I promise you, the enemy. We use fear again in the future and increasing suppressive measures. Let those with spiritual eyes see God and let those with spiritual ears hear God. And I'm talking to you about the spiritual. your enemy. The moment you allow fear to grip your soul, he will continue to tighten his grip until he brings you to the point of paralysis. I thank God 